Hi everyone, I'm Lawrence and in this video I'm going to talk about the two Shining Soul games on the GBA. Shining Soul is a hack and slash RPG. You start by selecting one of the four classes, Warrior, Wizard, Archer and Dragonude, each with different attacks. Wizards and Archers are long range characters whereas Warriors and Dragonudes are closed range characters. And the game follows a very linear pattern. You enter a linear dungeon, clear out enemies, rinse and repeat in different locations. Combat is basic and repetitive and what is even more annoying when you move in the clunky four directions is when you see that the game misses. <laughs> but at least the bosses are creative in the game. Overall the game is basic and dull, but you can have fun with it depending on your taste. And Shining Soul 2 improves the gameplay. Right from the bat, now there are 8 classes to choose from. And the cutscenes are much better. And you don't have the annoying pop-up that you missed. But the game still remained incredibly repetitive. Since all you do is fight in the same way. Even if you keep a different weapon. The attack is still the same. Only the stats have changed. Boss battles are still nice and very creative. And I like the graphical improvement. The gameplay is still ok and playable but also very repetitive and basic, making it hard to recommend. So Shining Soul on the GBA isn't bad, but it's really hard to recommend considering how basic and repetitive it is.